Good evening yet again. Um, I took the dogs for a walk and I listened to the video that I made and I am not satisfied with it. And I'm obviously not going to take it down because, well, I already made it. But I, I missed something and it was chewing at me and I went back and I looked at it again and this is what's chewing at me. This right here is from the Onus News video. And I I read it and I'm like, because I, I read the law section I, and fine, I just I just basically went off his research. And uh, I mean bites me in the butt every time. I just I just got uh I just got found out by Dennis uh in or pound sand that it's not if you're if you if someone blocks you then you can still see their posts. They just can't see yours. And I've never blocked anybody. I didn't know how it works. So I, I didn't know. So I was wrong about that this morning. Mea culpa. But I didn't want it. I didn't want anybody else to catch me on this. I caught it and I'm like, ah, don't you don't rely on someone who's obviously not educated enough or doing all the work to even read the full web page. And again, I just hate it. I hate it when they hide links. See, there's there's no link. So where did this come from? Cause I I didn't I'm like, why why does it have to why does it have to be a non-violent offense if there's insufficient evidence to if there's insufficient evidence, that means you don't have probable cause. If you don't have probable cause, then you should let them go. Right. So this is just chewing at me and chewing at me. And I'm like, I need to find where this is because there might be something I've never dealt with this before. 849 B. I've never dealt with it before. I mean, think about it. Somebody gets somebody gets released under 849 B. They're released. They don't come find to find a lawyer to say, sue the city because they let me out. I, I maybe there was something in there. So find it. Do your due diligence, as Fat Label would say. So I found it. It's right here. This is uh, the San Francisco Board of Supervisors. Uh, they did a write up on it. Uh, their big interest is that, you know, that they need to improve the tracking of Section 849B releases. And this wasn't written by lawyers, right? So they're, they're telling what Section 849B it states the peace officer may release from custody instead of taking such a person before a magistrate, any person arrested without a warrant whenever one. Uh, you satisfy there is insufficient grounds Two, the person was arrested for intoxication only or three, the person was arrested for being under the influence of a controlled substance or drug and such person is delivered to a facility or hospital for treatment and no further proceedings are desirable. Great. But then they throw this in there. 849B is used by law enforcement th agencies throughout the state to release from custody prisoners who have been arrested for nonviolent offenses. Now, where did this come from? And honestly, I think they just, I think somebody just threw it in there either haphazardly or I don't know, maybe, maybe San Francisco has a, a policy that if they arrest someone for a violent offense, then they hold them no matter what. You know, until until they go in front of a magistrate, even if the officer subsequently thinks there's there is a a lack of probable cause, who knows? I don't know. But what I do know is that 849B doesn't say anything about violent offenses. And but here's what here's what drove me to it. I was thinking about what I was reading. This is a section about bail and being released on his own recognizance. If you're not going to be charged with the crime, if the officer is satisfied there are insufficient grounds for making a criminal complaint against the person, then you're not being released on your own recognizance. You're you're being released. So this section doesn't apply. This is we're in the we're in the wrong damn area. And then and then this one referenced uh the other sections, eleven ninety two point seven and uh six sixty seven point five. So there's 1192.7, there's 67.5, but this is in the wrong area. So why was he, why was he bringing this up? Penal code 120 
or one two seven zero point oh one one two seven zero point one prohibits the release of an arrestee on bail on bail that's that's what he missed oh just oh Urgh. i'm i'm frustrated with myself i blame the alcohol um it is a it is a delightful rye bourbon tonight should have caught it didn't catch it so my bad uh he's looking at the wrong section and again again it's you know onus you you should put you should put links in i mean this is disingenuous right here so i mean i don't even i don't even know where he got this i don't know where he got this it it who knows He's not going. He's not going to the law sections, so I don't know where he's getting it. Uh, but that's that's why there are actual lawyers out there, and there there's not a whole lot of respect for YouTube wannabe lawyers or uh, propers who don't really understand what they're looking at and reading. So there's there's your me culpa. I should have I should have been more thorough and. There you go. I caught it before anybody else could. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.